Sons and Daughters of God for April 20th. The reading is entitled, Changes or Defiance to Submission. The scripture reading is taken from Hebrews 13, 17. Obey them that have the rule over you, and submit yourselves, for they watch for your souls, as they that must give account, that they may do it with joy and not with grief, for this is unprofitable for you. There are many young men and women who have no method in doing their work. Though they are always busy, they can present but little results. They have erroneous ideas of work and think that they are working hard when, if they had practiced method in their work and applied themselves intelligently to what they had to do, they would have accomplished much more in a shorter time. By dallying over the less important matters, they find themselves hurried, perplexed, and confused when they are called upon to do those duties that are more essential. Under circumstances like these, where young men and women are making such mistakes in their life discipline, it would be sinful not to speak words of advice and counsel. It is an extremely delicate thing to tell people of their faults. The reprover is likely to find that in those reproved, pride and stubbornness assert themselves, and the will is arrayed in defiance and opposition. But for all this, advice should be given, and faults should be laid bare. Let the young cultivate a teachable spirit, that they may be benefited by the efforts of those who seek to help them. It may seem that we are to study our own hearts and square our actions by some standard of our own, but this is not the case. This would but work deform instead of reform. The work must begin in the heart, and then the spirit, the words, the expression of the countenance, and the actions of the life will make manifest that a change has taken place. In knowing Christ, through the grace that he has shed forth abundantly, we become changed. In humility, we shall correct every fault and defect of character, because Christ is abiding in the heart. We shall be fitted up for the heavenly family above. Thank you for listening.